president of the Bahamas officials will this week memorialize former president and president emerita, the late Dr. Kevo Bethel, by holding a special exhibition on Thursday, a distinguished lecture series on Friday, and renaming one of the college's landmark buildings in her honor. The late educator becomes COB's first principal and then president in the 90s and was seen as a woman with a strong vision for education. Thousands of Bahamians have been impacted by Dr. Bethel's deep devotion to national development and a lifting the human spirit. Among those touched by Dr. Bethel are organizers Dr. Gail Saunders and COB's librarian Willa Mae Johnson. She was able to get me through my O-level Spanish examination. She later welcomed me as a colleague, um, teacher at the Government High School and as principal and president of the college we collaborated on projects when I served as director of archives. She was really a, a woman of all kinds of skills and um, just a kind and soft and tender um, nurturing has helped me tremendously in terms of my own personal development. Besides being a veteran educator, the late Dr. Bethel was a devoted mother. Her children, Nicolette and Edward, reminisced on their mother's influence on their lives. For her, it was a life of service. It was a life of development of the College of the Bahamas for the betterment of the country. And we feel that that's something that's important to pass on to future generations, that spirit of giving above and beyond, of not just being compensated for what it is you're supposed to do. My mom, you know, being the, the nurturing mother she was, would take me to all of my soccer games or my, my, my um, road running races and whatever. And she would be the one who would be there with, with, um, with, with me for all of that. Also when Nicolette and I participated in um, the New Providence concert band, um, she would come out and attend all of our concerts, take us to the, to the practices. So in addition to the public care of Bethel, she was also committed to family.